Katie, you were asked um, when Amanda first came on your radar, when did her promoter, Jake Paul, first come on? I can't think of two people who are less similar in the boxing world than you or Jake Paul. When, when did you first become aware of him and then his keen interest in, in your career? Uh, I guess I first became aware of Jake Paul when he had his first fight. Uh, fight. <laughs> years ago. A couple of years ago. Um, <laughs> that's my, my idea of a trash talk. That's not <laughs> <That's laughs> over. Yeah, that's not over. Um, but yeah, I guess that, that's when I became aware of Jake Paul. Um, uh, and then he obviously started working with Amanda, and here we are. Did you like? Were you surprised when it, when he got involved in this whole thing and kind of wanted to make it this big event? Because for a long time this was going to be a co-main event for I think it was Dillian White uh, for White and Chisora, I think. Mm. Um, did, like when when were you made aware that he wanted to make this this big event? Um, I don't. I mean, I, I just know that he was he's been working with Amanda for for the last couple of fights now, and and this and obviously we were in talks of. Uh, of myself and Amanda for, for a couple of years now and I'm glad that he's involved right now to actually uh, get this fight over the line. Um, originally I was thinking I hope I'm not on the undercard of a Jake Paul fight. <laughs> that would be an awful shame. <laughs> um, I can't believe I'm finding Amanda Spratt on, on a Jake card on, on her card, but uh, obviously we're here we are, we're headlining and, and Jake's been an absolute gentleman over these last few months as well. I can't say, say anything bad about him.